Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Big Mike here. Terry. Hey, it's Wednesday night, guys. It is. Lori. It's too early Lori, to go to bed. It ain't even, you act, it's Lori, just now getting dark. Listen, guys, Lori at LG acts like a grandma. Okay, she's not a grandma. She's not. She's okay? young. She's, she's young. She's, she's vibrant. She is. I need to go to bed. <laughs> but she does, she works hard. She does work hard. She does. We'll give her that. That's all we're giving you. <laughs> anyway, guys, hey, <laughs> welcome back to the channel. Hey, the secret channel, Canadian Family Life, nailed it. And Alexander I was confused. It was confused. <laughs> he got his fam and his family and, and his, his farm, farm mixed, all mixed up. up. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, yes, That's Canadian right. Family Life got it. It is Walker Farm Fam. That's right. Yes. Good channel right there. A good family. Is a good Holy family. smokes. Yes. It's a good family. I watched their video today. Well, we did. Uh, them looking for morels. Yeah. Where there are no morels. Where there are no. No. Your son. I mean, she found some mushrooms. Austin, our son. He found morels. He found them. He, as soon as he finds them, that's he butters they, them up and puts them in a pan. Uh, that's what they had for dinner the other day. Yeah. So Walker Farm Fam, guys. Uh, creators is uh, Cassie and Gary. Mm -hmm. They have 77.4K in subs. They have 833 videos, and they have 30.2 million views. Lot. Lots of views, okay? Um, it's a family of five. Both of them work full-time while raising kids, uh, foster caring, farming, outdoors life, and sports, okay? Um, also, they live on 60 acres, ra raise beef cattle, meat rabbits, chickens, pigs, quail, and they garden. Yes. Uh, they are a loving, uh, a loving family. You said cattle, right? I said meat, beef cattle. Oh. Uh, a loving family, um, a, uh, a face, faith based family for sure. Yes. Uh, we love meeting up with them every time we see go to a meetup or stuff like that, and just awesome, awesome people and Very parents. Good. Yes. Guys, uh, all glory to God with them guys, and they put it all in them children. Um, they also, besides all that that they do, people may not know it, if you didn't read their about page, they uh, love living a debt-free life. Uh, and also they teach a finance, financial peace class twice a year all right. on how you can become debt free also and live that way. Okay. That's what we need to do. What? We just have day to day debts. I mean, we don't have no, we have a credit, mortgage. We don't have credit card debt or well, anything like that. We've got, we learned that minor in, credit card. We learned that in previous marriages. We do not do it here. If the debit card says there's nothing on there, guess what? There ain't nothing on there. You can't have it. Yes. Step one. That's what it says in the rule book. <laughs> anyway, guys, yeah. So the family board, the family board, if you will, up there. Great subscriber, Debbie Drop. Yes. Yes. She is a, a loyal, faithful subscriber. She watches. She, she uh, leaves comments. And I mean, I see her on a lot of lives too. Yes. So guys, if you don't know her, get to know her. Mm. Chat with her in the chat if she shows up. Sure. I don't even know if she's here or not. We haven't checked it. Okay. I but see, I see Bowen at Thunderstick Homestead. There you go. So Terry, who do <laughs> hey, we got look, in the There's Debbie Drop right hey, below Bowen. There's Debbie Drop. She's on our family board. She's part of our family. Make her part of yours. That's right. Get to know her. She's a good person. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Paul. So how did Mike get his boat and tractor if we have no debt? <laughs> very, very slickly. Mm. <laughs> As part of that debt-free class. Mm. No, it's not. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I walked in there. Here's, here is the, the, the worst part. We'll get to everybody. The worst part of having a great credit score. Sure, go just take whatever you want, sign right here. Yeah. I go, wait a minute. When I was growing up, 
I had to bring like all kinds of forms of IDs, yeah. uh, uh, co-signers. And now in my life, they just go, because of her, okay, when you got like an 820 credit score, they just go, how many cars do you want? Right. No, just one, just yeah. one. I blew up hers. <laughs> I owe her a car. So there you go. So Thank if you, you're Randall. not debt free and you don't clean up your credit, guess what? Randall. Life sucks. Gypsy Trails. Hey. He says, Sorry, Mike. Missed Sergeant's chat last night. You oh, missed man. a good one. You need to go back and watch. We had a good one. We had a special guest. You got to go over there and check out who that was. First guest ever on the channel. Yes. Of course, it's only five videos out, but she, that person was the first guest on Sarge Talk TV. So go check it out. Yeah. We talked about family stress. We talk, you talked about a lot more than family we stress. Are, we, we, well, we have something wrong in our brains and we go off on tangents. Well, it's okay. It's okay. And that's what the channel is for. Yeah, that's why the VA pays us. That's right. So do we have the chat. <laughs> So Pacquiao was in here yes, this morning. Pacquiao. She was. Uh, Joe fix it for you. Hello, Joe. Alexander Dark Lord Minette. Uh, let's see. Out and about with Dave and Daisy, formerly known as Sam I Am. There's Jerry at Butler Family Farm. Hello, Jerry and Susan. Yes. There's Tracy Michael. Yes, I see. It's Tracy Michael. Tracy Michael? There's Laura. We missed her last week, didn't we? No, she came in right at the oh, end. Oh, she did. Yeah. There's Lori at LG Homestead. PTSD. I didn't remember. Um, Canadian Family Life, who who got the mystery. She got the cookie tonight. Yeah, she got Lila's cookie. Yeah. Because she, yeah, she got the the mystery channel. No, it's not Walker Family Farm. It's Walker Farm, Farm Fam. Fam. Yeah. It is. She, it is Walker Farm Family. She, I figured everybody would get it be, with the Walker. I do think it used to be Walker Family Farm, but they changed it. Yeah. So, yeah. Walker Farm Fam. Yeah. Mm. Did you say hello to Laurie at LG? Mike, there she is. Mike's in the house. There's Dana Mason. Hello, Dana. And guys, if you don't know somebody in here that pops up in this yeah, chat, write their name down and go back after yeah. you listen to us talk and talk and talk and uh, go over there and check them channels out, guys. Anyway, I was saying there's Dana, Mason, and Tim. Hey, guys. Still saying prayers and yes. sending love your way. Um, we thank you for watching. Yes. Um, Angie. 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 <laughs> Uh, My favorite VA nurse is in right. the house. That is right. Hola. I'm just gonna go up there for an appointment. I'm gonna I'm gonna there stalk go. her. Hola, Jovita. Jovita. Let's see. Everybody saying hello. There's Neil S. Hello, Neil S. There's Beverly Moffin. All right, Beverly. And there's Brian at the Vineyard Farmhouse. Leanne Gunther's in hello, here. Hello, Leanne. Let's see. There is Heartland Headquarters with Dink and Tink, hello, otherwise hello. known as Tamara and David. Hello. Yep. Hey, Jesse and Lisa's in here. Hey. Hi, Lazy Jesse days and, ahead. Jesse and Lisa, he said hello. I think, everybody. aren't they going live on Saturday this week? Um, they go live. When I they go live like, whenever Jesse feels like it. I know <laughs> that. But. I lost. I'm be sorry. damned who I step Jesse, on. <laughs> put, put in when your next live is going to be. Yeah. Maybe your next video. I, th I thought it was Saturday. Maybe it's not. Yeah. I know Scott at Rambling with the Room has Procrastination Thursday tomorrow. I know it comes on around, what, 12 o'clock yeah. uh, Central Time here? I need to do something on Saturday, too. Well, she's going to be gone. Friday. I'm gone. We'll talk about that in a minute. I'm going to be gone. Oh, but there was a cooking. She was in. I'll have to go back and look. Cooking channel. It was in the chat last night. I can't remember her name. I'm so sorry. We'll go back. But and find she's it. doing a, a live on Saturday, and she's cooking while she's doing the live. So you'll have to watch there that. There you for go. Me. Um, let's see. We also Evelyn Newman. Hey. hey. There's Anna Boer. There's Kevin hiking with Jackie Boer. Hey, Kevin. James Hall is here. All Glenda, right. Linda Bendel. Melody has two blessed cockins. There's <laughs> Ark Wildman. Survival's in the house. Hey, how you doing, brother? There's Southwest Living with Val. Wow. Yes. Uh, the Peanut Farm. Hello. Hey. 
Yeah. Pacquiao's been a member for three months. All right. Have a nice day, she says. Salute yeah. and thanks. And members, feel free to drop that that free thing in there that tell us how long you've been a member. Yeah. We we love to see those. Yeah. And we are a sponsor on her giveaway channel. Yeah. I haven't up yes. I haven't updated the commercial. I, I don't know why I'm spinning the mouse around this. They can't see that. No, they can't. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Oh, yes, Delilah, Jesse, and Lisa were heaven sent. I will agree with that. Hey, there is there is Christy Betts. Hello, hello. Hello. There's Heather Hopper, Julie Highstand, Anna DeVera. Hello. She said good morning. Oh, Paul says say hello to your pretty for us. I will do that. We call her pretty. Yeah. Today we call her crispy. <laughs> She's a crispy critter. She went out and laid out in the sun and burnt because yeah. she is pasty white. <laughs> but we love her. She got her mama skin. <laughs> I'm not that white. I actually yeah. tan. Once I I burn a little bit, but then I tan. Yeah. I not. Yeah. Although I've gotten whiter. That's the I, German in her. As I get older, That's my the skin German gets in paler. Her. Yeah. Yeah. She's yeah. yeah. Brittany, yes, definitely. Uh, There's two kinds of Germans. There's a pasty white, and there is a sunburnt red. <laughs> Gypsy, Gypsy Trail sent a $10 super chat and said, just so y'all know, MT gives a thousand pesos to all three months of anniversary. Well, um, no, but, you know. What is that? How much is that in dollars? What is that? A thousand pesos. <laughs> is it pesos? Yeah. That's, That's not. I don't have pesos. Who is that? They gave it. Huh? No, Randall. Randall said we give. Oh. A thousand pesos to all three months summer anniversary. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I, get, I get it now. Randall's, <laughs> Randall's fibbing. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah. What have I missed here? Glenn and hey. Shannon Salty Live. Hello, hello. Glenn said, feeling like the grandpa I am. <laughs> There's John's fishing and hunting. Hello. Is, is Brittany in here? Is Brittany in here, anybody? Did I miss something? I don't know. <laughs> Let's see. There's Troy Sutton. Hello. Uh, Mary Yahoo. Hey, Yahoo. Junk the gyms. Hey, there's Melody. His two blessed Calkins. She's here. There, there's, there's Liza DeVera. Hello, Liza. Mary and Gary. Junk of Jim. Yes, Mary and Gary. There's Foxcat Gameplay. All right. So is Ireland. Yes. <laughs> yes. Rainy Ridge. The gingers burn bad. <laughs> there, there is Rainy Ridge. Hey, Rainy Ridge. There's Jen Abby. Abby. Mm -hmm. You said hello to Evelyn. Yep. And Leanne and Paul and all these people. The There's Lone, Lone Cross. All right. There's the Moran experience. Hey, I've experienced them. Yeah. Fallen Arkansas veterans. There's Amy. Would you like Living to in Abundant Grace Hi, Amy. Homestead? I tore that up from the floor up on that video. Yes. What was I? What did I say? Living in Abundant Grace. Life. Life? Yeah. Yeah, I tore it up, and I'm sorry. Yeah. And they are Caternix Quail. Right. She squared me away. Yes. Yeah, thank you. So there's Charles at Fallen Arkansas yes. Veterans. And we would like everyone to say prayers for him. Um, go over there and yeah. show him some love and some support, please. Yes. Um, let's see. Amanda Dahl. Hey, Amanda. Chicks and quails are doing good. Yeah. They're crazy. The little chicks are crazy. They're all they're all crazy. The, your uh, your uh, chickens, yeah. your cinnamon queen that look like they have some kind of feather disease. <laughs> their coloring just does not look right. It, it is what it is. But no, I'll go out there and I'll talk to them. And I'm sitting there. I got my hands in the, the pen and they'll come over and start looking like, oh, what's this? And then one of them will freak out and run and then they all just Scatter. Yeah. And it's like, what What are you doing? They're doing chicken things. It, they're just crazy. Yeah. Isabel. But trust me, after a while, they'll know her and they'll just, every time she walks out the door, 
Because hey, there's the lady that gives us people food. Right. That's how you train your train your birds to stay around. Chickens had a pizza party under the coop last night. And then kitten, yep. kitten went out there this morning. They and had a pizza party going on. Kitten went out and finished off the scraps. In the morning? Yeah. Yeah. Did you say hi to Linda? Linda Peterson. Yeah. She's right there. Yeah. Hey, Annie Ann. I mean, not Annie Ann. Ann Dale. <laughs> Ann Dale. Miss Ann Dale. Miss Hello. Ann Dale. Oh, I see Annie. I'm going, Annie, Annie. Ann, Ann. Huh? Ann. Oh, she, see. She... Ovita Navarro says a thousand pesos is like twenty dollars. Mm. <laughs> she said he. <laughs> yeah. I don't think so. Yeah. Uh, Huga Homestead. There they are. Hello, Hugas. And there's Sandy at Team Lake. Lake. Or Lake. Lake. Yeah. <laughs> there's Marianne Bargo. Hello, hello. Rick's channel. I think I said that maybe already. Um, I'm, I'm, Randall, what are you doing? <laughs> what? Um, Randall sent another $10 super chat. Says, Mike, are you guys Easter okay? I'm in Blue Mountain and thinking of extending for a couple weeks. Yeah, we are in the on the east. E east. Eastern Oklahoma. We break the Easter. central part. I'm thinking Easter. Easter just got done. I'm like, Easter, okay. What? Yeah, we're on the east side. <laughs> yes, we are. We are on the east side. McAllister, Oklahoma. And if you're at Blue Mountain, then let us know and we'll see if we yeah. can meet up somehow. Uh, let's see. Celestial Tour. Hi, hello. Hello. I want to make sure we say hello to everybody before we start gabbing and talking smack. We, we've already started that. Oh, do we? Yeah. There's Kelly, Rebel at Heart. Hey, Kelly. Hey, there's Oak. Oak. Outdoor Adventures with Gary. Yeah. Lyrics. Who is that that sang Oak Tree? Oak Tree. I got to find that song. It was a song done, I think, in the 70s or 80s. It's an R&B song that talked about an oak tree. And every time I see that name or see her, I think oak. Hey, out and about with Dave and oak Daisy. Tree. $20 super chat from Dave and Daisy. Oh. Help, help a veteran fund. Yes. There you go. Yep. That is going to be going down to the uh, Veterans Homeless Shelter. Sure. Aaron McAllister. Let's see. What else do we have? I miss people's. There's Melva and Donnie. Hello. Hello, hello. They're saying hello to Debbie Drop. She's on the family board. That's right. That's right. It's me, George. Rick Greenlaw. Oh. <laughs> She's talking over me. She's on the deaf side, guys. It's me, Joyful Julie Cooking. There you go. Hello. And there's Lynn. No, I'm going to mess this up. Lynn Naguit. Team Ohio, be happy. Hello. Yes. <laughs> I am so bad at the, saying Oh, these man, names. I found a good channel. Some good channels over in England. Yes. Oh, and what about the Baltic one? Guys. That one was good. Guys, if, I'm, yes, I'm self-promoting. Go to our uh, community page. There is a channel on there called Baltic Homesteading. This guy met a gal from Latvia. Latvia, yes. Yep. He's from England. And they got married. They're living in England. And they had an opportunity to pick everything up and move to Latvia and where they're building their homestead and everything. Guys, good channel. And it's in English. Okay. Yes. Uh, she speaks English. He does too. And it is, a. I mean... Sure. Good Her channel. Her name was Gita. Yeah, something like I that. I remember his name. Yeah, but a very good channel, guys. I, I mean, sat when when I was off, I was just watching it yeah. for most of the day, just watching the videos because it's beautiful. Yeah. And their Easter one, how they do it, they the still eggs. do it from the olden days where they take an egg, a hard boiled egg, and they put it in this stained cloth, and then they take the flowers and stuff and they stick it to the egg. And then they wrap it up and then they boil it and it paints. It's like a good, a, someone who knows how to do it. It's just beautiful. 
and then you pull your flowers off and it looks it's all flower and everything like in the olden days mm -hmm. when grandpa used to tell stories <laughs> grandpa's still telling stories That's right. <laughs> so go check that out guys right. you'll enjoy that channel there's there's webs web hey webs web randy moore he said i retired debt free it's a great feeling yes yes that's what I keep trying to tell him. He's, we've got to get everything paid off before you retire. So that'd be good. My employees are going, dang it, hurry up and pay that off. <laughs> uh, uh, my Alaska, there is AK Bill. He's in the house. Hey, Bill. Um, Gary said, my ex used to say, I can't be broke. I still have checks. That's right. <laughs> I've lived that life in past years. Uh, Hey, Brian at the Vineyard Farmhouse. Hunt and Holler Ranch. There they are. Oh, Carrie's driving but listening. Oh. And hello, Hunt and Holler Ranch. You, did you say hi to Shirley de la Cruz? I did not. Hello, Shirley de la Cruz. Hello, hello from Team Ohio. Be happy. All right. Let's see. I'm, I'm so far behind. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, let's see. There's Bad Ram Boy Team Jolly Hunt. So All right. Hey, there's Rambling with the Broom. Scott is in. Hey, here. Scott. There's Mickey at Cr Critter Creek. Hey, hey. I would like that if he if he made us a logo out of that final drawing thing he did with the motorcycle and all that. Yeah, but that's so not me now. A cartoon character is not you. Well, that's true. So it doesn't matter. I would just like to have a copy of it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I put on a t-shirt. Yeah. A black t-shirt. This is my old lady. <laughs> you who know did, what? You, who you, did your ink? You, Mickey did. Do you know what he said he said to me before we got started tonight? What is I say a lot of things. He too. said I needed to go in the bathroom and run a brush through my hair. <laughs> I said I just brushed. Well, she was outside, and it's Oklahoma, so the wind blows. Okay. Yeah. She looked like she got up in the tornado. <laughs> My said, hair is all over the place today. It is windy. <laughs> but you do look good in those pants. Okay. <laughs> there you go. I'm a good husband, guys. I compliment uh, her all the time. There's Glenda Bendel. One time I say something. Mm. One time. <laughs> Got to drag it out. That's right. Oh, drag it through the mud. That's right. <laughs> yeah. uh, <laughs> what, who am I missing? I'm missing people. I know I am. I'm so far behind. She had the flu and I told her she looked beautiful. Mm. She said, get out. Go away. <laughs> get out now. Hey, there is, there is Brittany Holman. Hey, there she is. She was in My here. pretty. Well, I'm only, what? 15 minutes behind from when she said she was here. Hey, the peanut farm is in here. They are. The peanut <laughs> farm. Your hair is beautiful. I love right. the color. It is very naturally gray and blonde. Yeah. <laughs> so that is what it is. Yep. She is slowly turning into her mom and her it's getting uncle. whiter. <laughs> it will turn white later. Uh, let's see. Hey, there's Reverend Dream. Hello, hello, brother. Carlo. There is Carlo. Husky Edna. There she is. Right. <laughs> Guys, if you haven't subscribed to Husky Edna, get on over there. Love that woman. There's Love that woman. Jesse May. Hello. There's Bowen at Thunderstick Homestead. We are not near Fort Smith. We are no. we are over at McAllister in We're Oklahoma. We're two and a half hours from Fort Smith, right? Yeah, about two and a half. Yeah. Give or take. Um, we take the short. We take the shortcut to the forty-one point three six and yeah, in uh, David's place and all that stuff. You don't go all the way up there. All right, I'm trying to get scrolled down through here. Some I'm hoping I'm not missing any. I'm at the bottom. I am not. Oh wait, John's fishing hunting said, "Hey, I got good news with my mom. The doctors were looking at a nodule in her lung, and it's getting smaller, and it's not cancer. Yay!" Mm. That is good news. It is. And please, everyone, also say a prayer for Susie Jacobson because I don't, I don't know how well she's doing. I haven't heard from she, her. Her daughter says she's in pain, 
but yeah. she's got she's medication healing. and she's healing. She's healing. So, so yeah. Yeah. Keep her in your, keep her in your thoughts. Send her prayers and good vibes and all that stuff. Yeah. I remember a day well, when my daughter used to send me five dollars. <laughs> she don't she, send money no more. She, she's 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 they're in transition, so we'll leave it at that. Okay. There's Christy Betts. Hello, Christy. Five dollars. He, he don't Just need five dollars. He don't need five dollars. He's got he's got he's fine. So I can use it for tip money when I eat at the restaurant when mom's gone. Mm, no. <laughs> Lone Cross hashtag yeah. NTP. Yes. Right. Austin Stonelock is here. Hey, Austin. Uh, did you say hi to James Hall? Did I say hi to James Hall? You did. But see, Austin is a loyal, loyal friend. Okay. His uncle, haven't seen him in a month of Sundays. Doesn't even pop in here. I know. Doesn't say, hey, I'm but here, but I'm I'm Drew? working and I'm listening. Where's Drew? Don't see Drew. Don't see Lindsay. <laughs> I know. But hey, guess who comes through? Austin. Austin. Austin's the best. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, there's Gary, YouTube police. Hey, hey there he is. He says, sup. Sup. Uh, let's see. Neil S. said, so over the VA right now, got a letter telling me they had been trying to contact me about my MRI appointment. Called back three times and haven't heard crap from them. <laughs> that sounds about right. Guys, they call sorry, one Angie. They call one time. <laughs> Angie is a good person. From I'm sorry, time. Angie, but I'm on the receiving end of this one. <laughs> they call one time. Then they don't call again. Then they automatically, the computer sends out a thing and it says, we have been trying to get a hold of you That's and you're right. not answering. Okay, so here's a letter. Dude, you call one time. Because why? I tested them. They called. I didn't answer it. Two days later, letter in the mail. We have been trying to get a hold of you. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. So I call them up. Then I call them. I said, hey, stop sending me junk mail when you only call me once. No, sir, we're required. I said, no, 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 no. I got phone records. Liars. <laughs> Glenn and Shannon Salty Life said, I used to get really dark skin, mm -hmm. and then I needed to start needing to get odd looking skin cut off of me. Ooh. Yeah, that's never a good thing. No. no. I don't, I don't know. I get. Hey, we got a super skin. sticker. Hey, from Husky, from Husky Edna. Edna. Australian $14.99. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, such a, she's such a. Uh, a <laughs> good friend. Hovita says, my bad, a thousand pesos is 60 US dollars. A thousand pesos? Is 60 US dollars. Yeah, that'd be about right. <laughs> yeah, well, All I know is when I was a kid in no high pesos. school, and we used to take that, go down to, to the Sea of Cortez, which some people call it the Gulf of Mexico, but um, or the Gulf of California or whatever they call it. Um, we used to go down there, take the trains to Yuma and walk and hitchhike into Mexico. All you needed was your student ID or a driver's license and you can come back across in the seventies, right? right? All day long. And we'd go down there. I'd have maybe 30, 40 bucks. I stood a whole month down there on that money and came back with money in my pocket. Yep. Jen Abbey, Team Banner, hello. That's right. I'm still trying. All right. So I'm I'm at the end. <laughs> hey, our cabin in the woods. There's, uh, there's, there's Gip, Tony. He Gipsy, showed up. Gypsy Trail said, I take it back. No soup or pesos for you. Yeah. <laughs> He's a soup Nazi tonight. And so we did pesos. have a live last night, um, uh, Jason and myself, and uh, we had our special guest come on there. We talked about on Sergeant's Talk TV – and if you haven't subscribed to Sardis Talk TV, hey, it's something different. It's conversation. Uh, we try to keep the chat going and post their, their comments and answer their questions and stuff like that. But we choose a subject about the military and military life each week. And last night, uh, we stayed on a little bit long. I mean, it really got going. It was almost two hours. Almost two hours. 
uh, but we talked about mission uh, mission readiness, um, combat deployments, and family stress, and how all that affects the family dynamic yes. uh, and stuff like that. So it was a really intense. Uh, our special guest gave, I mean, firsthand knowledge of what a spouse of a military member had to go through raising children, saying goodbye, goodbye, being in charge of a family. So it was, it was, there was some emotional parts in there. And I'm going to tell you something. It's if, if you've got people in the military or you're in the military, you're a vet, you can relate to that. If you're falling in love with somebody that's in the military, my first advice, like I said last night, run. run. <laughs> okay. It's a hard life it for, for a family. It is. I'm just saying that. Um, but if you can stick it out, there you know, nothing can break you up. If the government and the military didn't break you up, you got something special. That's right. That's right. Hello, Johnny at Gillum Farm. Hey, Johnny. Hello to the Dyer family. The Dyers are in here. Hello. And hello to John Wiggs. Yeah. And there's Gypsy Trails again. It's military intelligence in a nutshell, laugh out loud. As a vet, I love it. There you go. Thank you again, thank you. Randall. Randall, you don't have to do that all the time. But thank you for your yes. service. Yes. Tis a hard life to be a mom also. Yep, it is. Yeah. Because all we do is pack our bags and we leave. We leave everything behind. Lila says it's snowing there. Ooh, what? Did I say hi to Lila? I don't know. I don't think we said hi to Lila. Hi, Lila. <laughs> yes, oh, Lila. Everybody's still saying hi to each other. Yes. Uh, so we did that. We did that. Uh, we did put out a video on Monday, uh, update on the quails and the little chicks and stuff like that. And, uh, we did have a visit from David. He came and got my trailer with all his windows. So stay tuned for that video. Uh, he picked that up. He dropped his trailer off that he tows Uber around uh, for side jobs. <laughs> and uh, I got to load that up with telephone poles. There you go. So yes, we're just Paul. doing the trailer swap. Paul said military intelligence is a contradiction in itself. It is. <laughs> So, mm -hmm. yeah. Um, so we did that. Um, Randall, I saw Dot last week. She was in, yeah. in the chat. I haven't seen her this evening no, anywhere, but I, have not. I did see her last week. I didn't see her in, I haven't seen her on a chat tonight. No. There's Rebecca Touched by Yarn. Hi, Rebecca. You, oh, she's cool. going to send you a picture. All right. All right. Yes, and so we did that video. Um, we, I put Terry put up a short for me today. Okay, what was that short? You did a short. There was a short out of it Korea. Was just a, yeah, it was a clip from a throwback. Thursday. Yeah, she was trying that remix thing on your phone, yeah. where you can take a, a certain amount of of a video and, and throw up a short because uh, the dyers. We were talking to them on the phone I say, hey, the other day, and he, like, he told us about that. Yeah. And she she couldn't remember, but she was wait a minute. I did that before. I did it once before. Yeah. It's been a while. It's pretty cool, guys. Um, and then uh, it it's like a teaser on your shorts for people to go over and watch your videos too. Mm -hmm. um, so we were talking to the Dyers, and uh, we just got to see them again at the Okie Homesteading Expo. And you bought some candy from them. Yes. Um, so yes, uh, we did that. And what else did we do? Um, uh, what did we do? Oh, and then today you put up a short for me. Yes. It was one of my employees birthday. Happy birthday, Angela. Yes. Um, and, uh, I told the people we, I took her out to, to lunch in my, my headquarters staff. I took them out to lunch today and, uh, at a Mexican restaurant. Uh, and I told the guy, I said, Hey, it's her birthday. And they sang her happy birthday. They put the big sombrero on her. I didn't know this next part was going to happen. 
So go check out the short and see what happened. Make Angela after they employee go viral. Yes. <laughs> there you go. See what happened after they said they had sombrero on her. Mm. It was funny. She wasn't laughing. <laughs> but go check that out. It's it's funny. Let's see. Oh, and it's on uh, the uh, the shorts feed. <laughs> Paul, Paul said, tie a yellow ribbon around the old oak tree if you still want me. Laughing out loud. Damn it, Big Mike has me showing my age now. There you go. Yes, and that and someone said, I think it was Rick Greenlaw said that that was Tony Orlando and Dawn. Yes, and but I, I remember this. There is, and and but there is another one. And I can't remember the guy's name, but I'm going to find it. Okay, uh, it's it's an R and B. Tony and Lando and Don were basic. I mean, they weren't. I don't know what genre they would be in, but they just did their last performance in Vegas. Wow, he's been going a long time because I remember him as a kid. Were they kind of disco. I don't know. They were pop. I, I don't know what. Yeah, I don't know. Some something something in time. It was a group. Morris Day in the time. There you go. Morris Day sang it. Jungle Love. Jungle Love. Sounds just like the Bruno Mars song. Yeah. 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 See? All you gotta do is give her a clue. <laughs> Don't go on a game show with her. <laughs> yeah. Yes, that is a good question. Kelly, how is Sean doing? Yes. Tell him we we miss him. Yes. Hopefully we get to see him at the end of the month at the uh, Lake 10 Killer Meetup. Yes. We're going to be there Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday and leave out on Monday morning and come home. Yep. Uh, Kelly said he is good. Good, 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 good. And wasn't it last Wednesday we were on Brian's show after we got off and it was his hundredth yes. episode, his hundredth live. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he just hit 100 lives. Yep. And Brian said, nice shirt, Mike. <laughs> right? <laughs> Checking out my grapes, are you? <laughs> well, technically they're his grapes. It's my shirt. <laughs> That's true. Can't have it back. Uh, Blue brings out my. So we said hi to in Angie. In front of my, 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 my beard here. We said hi to Angie. Did you say hi to Tony? I did say hello to Tony. Okay. Yeah. I missed that somehow. Hi, Tony. Yeah. So, yeah, we're. Uh, I mean, I, I can't wait. I, I really miss. I mean, it's been too long. We haven't been to it. Well, we went to the expo, but Pinecone Fest, it's too long in between there to get together with everybody. Now we're going to go overload. Yep. Hey, and next year, hint, hint, there might be another YouTube meetup or slash expo in the works for 2025. Not saying nothing, just... Mm -hmm. I heard a rumor. We've heard we've heard a rumor. And I trust the I trust the people. It's a trusted source. It's a trusted source. I can't tell you no more, but Christy Christy Bet says somebody sent me a blonde joke and said, You're blonde, right? I said, No, that would be gray. My hair was almost black when I was younger. Yeah. AK Bill said you can always come up to Alaska. <laughs> We're going to next year. Next year, August. Oh, uh, let's see. Yeah, I always told people that my blonde was cam camouflage when they do the blonde joke thing. I'm like, mm, it's it's camouflage. <laughs> I'm not not exactly the dumb blonde. Oh, Dana says so far, as long as nothing happens, we are going to fly into GTR Columbus, Mississippi at 2 p.m. Thursday and leaving there to head towards Oklahoma. All right. Well, let us All know. Right. And you're going to be out there. Yes. Um, I think they're coming for the 10 cup. Yeah. 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 More stay in the time. Hey, look, it's travel escapes with the brooms. Hey. 
Scott's been posting his Puerto Rico videos. Yes. I videos. went to Puerto Rico when I was, I think it was like 85 or 86. I want to go to Puerto 86, Rico. 86, I went to Puerto Rico. Went to Fort Buchanan for the National Guard there, uh, or the reserves was going on their two-week summer drills. And I had to fly there to San Juan, Puerto Rico, and watch them pack everything up. And then they came to Louisiana, where I was stationed at. And then I had to go through. I had to grade them on all this stuff that they were doing, all their tactical there. procedures and stuff like that. You guilted your daughter. Two dollars. And she said you get two dollars at best. <laughs> two dollars. <laughs> I can tip somebody a dollar a breakfast. <laughs> Or 50 cents, because you're going to be gone four days, right? Yeah. yeah. 50 cents, that's all you get. That's your tip. No. <laughs> uh, well, shh, the cops are here. Sup, Gary? What's <laughs> up? Hey, there's Tracy at TNT Adventures. Hi, Tracy. There she is. I, I heard something on the chat. She was in the in the live last night. Uh, I, I, I was watching it while we were talking excessively. But something I think she was either married to a service member or something like that. Yeah. I've I seen a couple of things. I don't know if is that true, Tracy? James Hall said, I don't ever see any of the Arkansas crew in your life. Well, Mel, Mel and Gary come in. Mel yeah, comes in. They come in. Occasionally. She came in to Sergeant. David talk comes last in night. every once in a while, but they're they're busy. They're busy and they're putting kids to bed. And, yeah. Especially that it, yeah. around this time of night, they're putting kids to bed, yeah. doing homework and all that stuff. So we understand. Yeah. Um, Mama V makes it in occasionally, but she always says it's her bedtime too. So. Yeah. But she comes in yeah. and um, uh, Tim comes in. And occasionally. I know he's West Tennessee, but he don't yeah. count. But, you know, right now he can't do nothing they, but lay around, right? Yeah, they drop by. Yeah. Occasionally. Yeah. And that's fine. We understand. And the good thing is, is, um, you know, we go to Arkansas. And there's nothing holding us at the house. Kids are grown up and stuff like that. And we go over there and visit them. And we got to get back. It's been too long. It's been, it, we haven't been in Arkansas since uh, um, Freedom Fest no. at Davis. No, we have not. We got to get back. Paul said that you were just jealous that I still have hair. Oh, I can grow hair. It's just not where I want it to be. <laughs> this whole tan part, see the tan part? Wherever it's lighter back there, that's where the hair grows. That's fertile ground right there. Reverend, so. Reverend Dream says, can't talk about the VA because Dad said if nothing good to say, bite your tongue. Yeah. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Scott, Scott said, she's such a giving person. I'm sure he was talking about Brittany. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, she, she's a very she giving is. person. She is. She gives the best birthday or Christmas gifts, I'll tell you she, that much. She does. I love her. All right. And know what she said in response to that thing on the video? I buy you the best, Dad, so when if anything happened to you, it all comes back to her. <laughs> she's hiding her, her future in the <laughs> shop. Uh Oh, Lori, Lori told YouTube police to keep an eye on living in abundant grace. That Lori said she believes she's she might be up to no good. Ah, uh, yes, she she says yes. Married to one army, yes. All right, so she could relate. Mm -hmm. That was Tracy at TNT Adventures. Very, very much trying to get to the bottom. <laughs> I'm already at the bottom. I know you are, but you started at the bottom. Well, kind of midway. I didn't. I started at the top. Now I can't catch up. What is that? Nunya, Texas. Hey, hi, Jake. Hi, Jake. Are you wearing khakis? <laughs> From State Farm. Um, I, I love his. Uh, uh, there's love plenty. His aluminum foil. Cowboy <laughs> right? James Hall said, anybody going to Tin Killer have a couple trees I can hang a hammock in? There's all kinds of trees. Yes, there's all kinds <laughs> of trees you can hang hammocks from. Yep. Yep. 
Oh, Gillen Farm said he does remix all the time. Had a short hit over 140,000 K a couple days back. Who's that? Johnny. Hey, back with oh, the yeah. set. Hey, there's Maddie. Hi, Maddie. Hi, Maddie. When are you going to come out and go fishing? Yeah. When are we going to go fishing? <laughs> well, you're going to Waco now. I know. Now I can go fishing. There's nobody to nag me and say, go do something. Because I do that all the time. <laughs> they don't know that. Oh. They don't know that. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, oh, and you can only do Remax. On, uh, re, Remax. <laughs> That's a realty. You can only sell your, your channel once. <laughs> yeah. So this is it. No, you can only do Remix on your phone. Yes. Yeah. That is true. Thank you to Dyer Family Farm. Yeah, for they're letting saying that. Oh, yeah, right next to here. We're looking on here going. We're looking on the yeah, video. It ain't there. It's not there. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. On the phone. On the phone. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Mom, Mama V did get 3 million views now. Yeah. She's up to 3 million views on her channel. Yes, that's yes, awesome. Yes, indeed. That is true. I guess I'm going to have to buy stuff pretty soon to make chili with. For the chili cooking. Yeah, you got to do the chili cook-off at 10 color. Yeah. Yep. Although. Although what? That over-the-top chili that David was talking about. I may have to try that. Where yeah, they are. The VA is better than they were 30 years ago. Yeah. Much better. The VA, you used to walk in the VA, they had like a tape measure on the doorway. So the camera comes in um, and films when you come in. So if you die in the VA, they know how how tall the casket needs to be. <laughs> That's an old VA joke. Mm -hmm. They never did. But in it was a joke. Phelps County, they have it because I've seen it. <laughs> That's in case somebody, an active shooter or something like right. that. They have a measuring thing. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Lori said she's thinking about showing up for work tomorrow. <laughs> you know. I'm thinking about that too, Lori. But I've got a seven o'clock meeting. <laughs> so you, you got to show and up. And I'm in charge of it. <laughs> mm, you definitely have to be there. Uh, I gotta figure out. Wait, a way. all these people graduated. Hovita graduated in '85. James Hogg graduated in '86. Kelly graduated in '86. I graduated in '87. I was right there with y'all. She's a baby. Lori doesn't remember what year she graduated. She knows. Everybody knows. Mm hmm. Um, I just seen somebody. Hey, there's our uh, vlogs. There they are. Hello, our vlogs. Yes. And then I seen somebody else. Um, oh, Rice Lewis. Hello, hello. Rice Lewis. Um, Neil S. said, I spent seven months on Vegas Island, took the ferry from San Juan. I want to go to San Juan. I want to go. You want to go to that island that. Uh, well, I want to do that too, but I want to go to Old Town, San Juan. Yeah. The Umbrella Street, the Governor's yeah. Street. Johnny graduated in 83. I learned that from Scott, you know. Well, I learned that from the tour bus lady while Scott was filming. Oh. The Umbrella Street was the Governor's. Charles, he graduated in 71. All right. And then Melody in 77. Well, I graduated in 79. Gary graduated in 83. Gillum Farms graduated in 83. 83. Tony, it was in 80. Webb's Webb, 73. Rick Greenlaw was 87. Yeah. Clinda Bindle, 78. Rebecca got her GED in 82. All right. Awesome. Uh, Debbie Drock was 74. Yeah. Evelyn mm -hmm. Newman, 86. Oh, Christy Betts. Life on Dyer Family Farms, 87. 87. There we go. 
Butler's in 75. Christy Betts said these days I'm Neil S lot, is 89. A lot of times a lot of times sleep by now, she says. Oh, look it. I could be right now. Gary at YouTube Police, he's a baby. Oh. 93. 90, well, that was the college. Moran experience said, is 97. Gary said if you're counting, counting college. Oh. That's the, I graduated in 79, then I graduated college in 84. No. When did I graduate college? In 2004. Good night, Lori. Yeah. Yes, I know I'm behind. She's probably already gone. <laughs> I stay behind in that way. Lori has to stay longer. I know. Because I don't see that she's leaving and she won't leave until I <laughs> <laughs> Hey, there's Tish. She's back from her meeting. All right. Hi, Tish. No judgment here with Tish Ross. Tish, Tish is an author. Yep. And you ordered one of her books and stuff, didn't you? Yeah, it was a book and a journal. Um, yeah. There's Josh at Sherman Family Farm, 87. I need to drop a link for that. Who's your somehow. age? No, that that was when he graduated from being an unborn. I was going to say, there's no way Josh is as old as me. That that's when he was born. It was when I graduated from being an unborn baby. Oh, okay, yeah. I, I should have read say, the whole thing. That, that didn't make sense. But <coughs> okay, um, yeah, I, yeah. I wonder if I can drop a where, link. I where was I in eighty seven? Eighty seven. I was in school. <laughs> or I was in Massachusetts. Yeah. Huh. 80, I was in the full to gap. All right. Yeah. I was there from 87 to 91. So I was there when the the Berlin Wall went down. And we went on alert and our general was telling the president or the Bundes counselor of Germany, it would be nice if you would let the people with the guns know you were bringing the wall down. Because yeah. we had tanks rolling to the border, helicopters loading up. I mean, we were in full combat mode and nobody told us with the guns that they had to, they, the Russians were moving out. We didn't know. We had no clue. We were like, they wanted to keep it quiet. But guys, come on now. 60 tanks, like, you know, two or 300 of them rolling to the border on the highways and freeways. Leilani. It was pretty radical. Leilani Kimono. I'm hey, sure Leilani. Pronounce that wrong. Yeah. You know. What is this? When a. Winicious gameplay. Oh, there you go. I don't know. I'm, I'm Winicious guessing. gameplay. Hello, hello. I, I'm I'm sure I pronounced Glad that you came wrong in. too. Uh, hey, there's Sherry May B. Christy Betts is turning into a pumpkin. She said good night. Good All night, right. Christy. Um, hey, before you go out, make sure you hit that thumbs up for me, guys. Can I do it? Thumbs up. Yeah. Just like that. It looks just like that, it guys. It does. What, what are you doing? I don't know. What There's supposed doing? to be something like when you do this. Oh, yeah. Okay. It ain't working. You do the heart thing. Is that the heart? Yeah. Oh, right. Of yes. <laughs> Alexander said they used to have that measuring tape in banks, too. Yes. Yes. They absolutely did. Yeah. Probably still do. Yep. She is from Brazil. All right. All right. Winalicious. Winnie, is it? Winicious. Winicious. Gameplay. Okay. Yep. Yeah. From Brazil. I, I'm saying it wrong. I'm sure. Tina says that's scary that the VA was actually worse than they are now. Yeah. And there's Pacquiao. She's back. Hello, hello, my friend. John's fishing, honey, and graduated in 07. Oh, okay. Reverend Green was class of 81. Making it home. Hello. Making it home. Said, Hi, Mike and Terry. Really looking forward to meeting y'all at Tin Keller. Are you coming to Blue Mountain? Yes, we are. We we'll, are we'll, coming. We'll be there. at both. Yeah. Jesse was our first member also. 
He's been a member for seven months. He has. He just changed the blue? <laughs> no, I clicked Oh, I, I clicked it. <laughs> Wow. I have no clue, guys. I've seen it turn blue. I go, wait. Rice Lewis, you said hello to already. Yes. Oh, Rick Greenlaw graduated in 87. Really? I think we mentioned that already. I think I finally got down to all that. Yeah. Um, YouTube police said 50 years old when I went through police academy. Wow. Wow. Was it at the geriatrics uh, police academy? <laughs> No. Because when I went through when I went through Arizona DPS in Guadalupe, Arizona, man, I'm I'm glad I was the age I was because they ran me to death out there in the desert. See, our cabin in the woods said Josh is still wearing diapers. Yeah. Gillen Farm said Josh is younger than both our daughters. <laughs> uh... Oh, she's been here since we started. Oh, I thought you came in and you left. I'm sorry, Pacquiao. I said she came in earlier. Oh, okay. <laughs> you missed it. <laughs> I missed it all. Sherry may be suck me holly or jolly hugs. All right, Sherry. Where hey. Huh. Did uh Ginger Snaps in here? Did you say hello? To, there she is right there. Yeah. Hi. She just said she's late. She was camouflaged in the white lettering. Mm. You know what I mean? She was camouflaged <laughs> yes. in the white lettering. Hi, Ginger. There you go. I got I, I to gotta be able to see my Ginger Snap. I have got to find that link for the... Page and you're supposed to send her an email on she's what we're bringing for the giveaways for Den Killer. She's in charge of that. Oh. And I don't need her yelling at me when I bring stuff. And okay. Because Johnny don't want three-hour giveaways. <laughs> <laughs> well, to our thing, we had a, a little break and a pause for the cause. Let's see. All right. Hey, I made it to the bottom. There right, you go. Right before we have to go. Oh, she says, oh, my, I'm a Smurf. You're Smurf. <laughs> there you go, Ginger. You're Mama Smurf. <laughs> and there's uh, Daddy Smurf, Gillum Farms. Yeah. He's got the white. He's got the whiteness. I'd, I'd make it Papa Jesse, Smurf. but Jesse is the mod father. Yeah. Papa Smurf. He can make people swim with the fishes. Hey, Joe Jacobson. Hello, hello. Hello, Joe Jacobson Is from it, Eastern Iowa. Eastern Iowa. Yeah, there you go. I knew Iowa. Yeah. See, I always remember because I have family in Iowa. So. Yeah. yeah. So we got three minutes left, guys. Hey, guess who graces us? Hi, Christine. Christine, Miss Gillum Farms is in the house. She is. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, she is. I'm trying to think if we so, have um, you're going to Waco. I'm going to Waco. Spend the weekend with our daughter. I'll leave I'm going to be a geographical bachelor here. Yes. Taking care of everything. Mm -hmm. And you'll be calling me to check up on me and all that stuff. And what'd you have for dinner and what'd you do? And yeah. Blah, blah, blah. And I spent all your money. And anyway, <laughs> just kidding. Hello, Beth. Uh, <laughs> You didn't get so that she's doing that. If I I'm staying here. Um, I think I'm going to pick up telephone poles on Friday because uh, employees can go out there and pick that stuff up. So it, I'll get those out here. I got to get four barrels for Gary for his project out there on the pond. I got to get him four more barrels on top of that. So we'll see what we can get. Um, um, that's what I'm doing this weekend. Um Next weekend on Sergeant's Talk TV, mm -hmm. uh, we are talking about the top 10 states for veterans to retire in. Best states. The best states for you to retire in based on what the state does for you. Right. There you go. So if you're not happy where you live, maybe you want to move to one of these if you're a veteran. So <laughs> that's what we're going to talk about. And if your state didn't fall in there, hey. 
they're not good. No, I didn't. Give if him, you're a veteran, I don't give him a honey do list. No, I don't think I've ever given him a honey do. It's list. just like it's like whatever. When's he gets that going to get done? He get yeah. The only thing that I've said lately was I say, when's the laundry going to get done? And she gets mad at me. <laughs> she hates laundry. I hate laundry. Hates it. Hate laundry. She'll I cook all day well, and wash dishes, but hates laundry. I don't mind throwing it in. The, I think we've discussed this. throwing it in there is the easy. Part. I, I don't mind putting it in the washer. I don't mind putting it in the dryer. Folding it's clothes. It's the folding clothes. I don't mind hanging stuff up. Yeah. I just don't like folding clothes. Yeah. And that's why we have 2,000 T-shirts hanging in our closet. <laughs> we don't have that thing Sheldon has where you fold the clothes. That would make it funner. Funner? Funner. More fun? More fun, as Jason says. <laughs> <laughs> More funner. More funner. Um, yep. Let's see. Not for nothing, Homestead said. Mike, Sergeant Talk TV was so good last night. I was enlightened. There you go. There you go. And because she has a daughter-in-law that's in the service. Yes. Yep. And also Skinner Farms. I don't know if anybody saw that. They put a video out. They their house was told in a fire while well, the basement was, was still good. It was the first was floor. Was it Skinner? Second. Yeah, Shane. Skinner. I thought it was started with a K. No. Oh no, Kinfolk. 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 Sorry. Skinner, not Skinner. Kenfolk Farms. Not just a hat rack. Wow. Guys. Not just a hat. I'm losing my mind. All right. Kenfolk Farms. Sorry. Everybody's going to go Shane. over there and send money to the Skinners now. No, don't, don't, not Skinner. They'll be like, why are we getting all this? Kenfolk Farms. Yes. That's Cherry messed up. Kenfolk Farms of Georgia. Yeah. They, their place was destroyed in a fire. So go show yeah. them some love. I, he did say that they're doing okay. They've got insurance and all that. So, but still, you can't replace a lot. But you can't replace things. And yeah. yeah, go show them some love. So, anyway, guys, hey, Linda Peterson says, Big Mike, that is the point, not having washed. Them. Okay. <laughs> all right. So, anyway, guys, hey, we got to get out of here. Brian at the Vineyard Farmhouse is. Up next, he is uh, open mic. I believe. Go check him out, guys. Tell him MT Homestead sent you. Do a love raid. That's right. Bunch of red hearts. Yeah. Blue hearts, green hearts. It don't matter. Just harding. Okay, harding. Hey guys, remember yes. be kind to one another. Help somebody in need, and always, always thank the vet each and every day if you run into one. And also, guys, we love you. God bless you, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye, guys. Bye. Happy fingers. Happy fingers. I know there's something that, isn't it like you have to do this or something? I don't know. It's supposed to be fireworks. I don't know. It ain't working. No. It's no. All right. Good night. I know this does it. Bye, guys. <laughs> have a great Bye. weekend. Bye. Sorry, Brian. <laughs>